guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm just putting away some cherries, so I thought I'll just quickly show you um, one of the ways that you can pip your cherries. Um, one of these hard uh, st straws, or you can have a, a chopstick, or um, one of those skewers that you get to do the shish with. Just want to get a bottle, hold uh, so that your cherry is on top and just give it a push and then the pip will come out that way. So you'll have cherries like that, pips. So again, like so. Hold the cherry so you don't go down. And just by turning it and pushing it, Like so, you get your. This one's a dim fold. You get your cherries, pip that way. Like so, hold it. Whoops. I was just going to say, if they're too small, they might go down the um, down the bottle. Try and hold on to them. Like so. So you get your cherries. You can uh, freeze them as whole as well, or you can always get a knife and just um, go round with the knife. So you're just going completely around, and then by opening it up, like so, and then just take the pip. Uh, that's another way. They use paper clips to get them out. There's several ways of um, clipping them. And then just these seal bags. Pour them in or in containers. Like so. And there you have it, ready to be used to make a cherry pie or a smoothie, whatever, when necessary you've got a hold of them there. So that's one way of doing it. It is, um, they do get messy as well from wearing a glove and what I've also done is I stuck these in the freezer just for um, about 10-15 minutes as you can see some of them are like starting to get uh, frozen. It just make it helps it better when you're doing this process. So hold on to it and then just push it like so. Okay, until next time. Take care, have a good day. Bye for now.